hello 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 and welcome back and we are going to continue our build um, of uh, Goose Bay in Newfoundland Labrador um, Canada so in this segment we are going to continue with building uh, the southern district of let's see what it's called here. Um, let me just get, let me just remove. Let me just see on Google Maps. Here's a Happy Valley Goose Bay. That is what is called Happy Valley Goose Bay, um, <clears throat> which is going to go inside here. So uh, let me just go ahead and actually put in the district. Happy Valley Goose Bay. Valley Goose Bay. Good. Okay. <clears throat> and um, yeah, there it is. So let's get started on that. Um, let me make sure I have everything set up correctly here. Mic's on desktop. Okay, good. And this time I have a uh, full live view. Uh, which I forgot to do last time, unfortunately. Um, okay, I do apologize. Um, so let's see the road here. The Kelland Drive goes all the way over to there. Okay, so Kelland Drive. We could just make this. This goes up and around. Okay, so let's deal with Kelland Drive first. Um, I'm going to go up and around and kind of weasels a little bit um, try to recreate that a bit see how far it goes but till there it comes around like this okay and let me go ahead and name it uh, Kelland Drive it comes up to all the way to there good okay and so let me see how this the next road that's going to come up here is going to be called Churchill Street. Um, so Churchill Street, put it over here, and then it curves and it goes straight up into that road. Um, it's Kelland Drive. So let's name it. Churchill Street, Churchill Street, <clears throat> okay, and then we're going to have Brett Street, Lethbridge Street, okay, one thing at a time, so let's, Brett Street, okay, we have Brett Street that comes up to here, And then we have another street here. What is it called? Lethbridge Street. And Leth Lethbridge Street. Uh, that'll be straight road. Okay. Let's go to name it Leth Bridge Streets. Brett Street, uh, Brett Street, Brett Street, Lethbridge Road, uh, oh, Lethbridge Street, okay, Lethbridge Street, okay, and so those here, then there's another little road that comes out, which I'm going to put in here. Um, and this one is called, let's take a look here, Justin Avenue. Justin Avenue. Okay, and let's see another north, mm, there isn't much of a north-south road that goes there. A little bit complicated the way the roads go here. There's Ike Street, Bird Street, okay. Let's do Ike Street. Ike Street, and there's a crescent at the end, okay. So let's put in Ike Street. <clears throat> there's 
so it's called Ike Street. Ike Street. And then down here, and we have a road that comes across. And that road is called Bird Street. Uh, Bird Street. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so then inside here we have um, Michelin Street. Michelin Street. Okay. So I'm seeing how this goes here. Uh, Michelin Street. And then these come around as well. There we go. Okay. So this is called Michelin Street. Michelin Street. Uh, probably named after the tire. Uh, Ford Street. Uh, okay, we're going to leave that for now. So we have, we have Adam's Loop. Uh, let's see how Adam's loop comes. Okay, so Adam loops. Adam's loop, which comes over here. And extends to over here. Adam's loop, okay. And these come out here, like this. And then, Tuxashina Road, okay. So to uh, let me get the Tuk Tashina Drive. Tuk Tashina. Tuk Tashina Drive. Okay. As I'm doing this, I think that I'm going to populate this with uh, some residential buildings over here. So let me start zoning this for residential because we'll start. This area can start to develop. No reason why we shouldn't get this going. Okay. And we have a population of 18, 1,800, almost 1,900 people. Okay. And this will actually be made commercial over here. We already know that. Okay, very good. Okay, and let's uh, so let's continue the road network a bit here. Um, Kellen Drive, we have. Winter Crescent. Ford Drive will continue to here. And we have Winter Crescent that will come here as such. Okay, so this is called Winter Crescent. Okay, and then that road here is called De Harving Drive. This will actually continue, the Harving Drive will continue all the way to here, okay. Oh, no. Uh, remove that. So this will be called the Harving, oh, no, I've got the wrong road. Wrong road, wrong road. Took this, drop the Wrong way, okay. Deharving Drive, 
deharving drive. I got that correctly. Deharving, yes. Okay, and then we have white crescent. White crescent. Okay. White crescent comes here. White crescent. Okay. <clears throat> Continue on here. Um, we have 10th Street, literally called 10th Street. Mm -hmm. 10th Street and then there's Broomfield Street. Okay. So 10th Street, which goes all the way up halfway to. Okay. Um, Tenth Street. Uh, let's find a good place for it. Okay, there we go. So this is called Tenth Street. Tenth Street, just like that. <clears throat> okay. And then there is a road at the bottom here, but I don't think I have space to put that in, so I'm not going to. Um, hmm. Interesting how this goes. And then we have a crescent that comes around, and that's Windsor Avenue. Okay. So we have a crescent. comes around and then it's called Windsor Avenue Windsor Avenue okay which comes around like that okay so we have that developing I think it's time to build a school um, Let's see where the school will go. Uh, we really should put a school in. Um, well, that's over there. Um, Okay, it seems to be over to the east a little bit more, but I think I will put the, this in here. So, Inu Education. I will put in the Inu Education. So, let's get a school here, a small school. We're going to make this the Inu Education. Inu edu Education. Okay. And uh, let's see how fire coverage is. Uh, really bad over here, so let's get a fire station in here. And this will be the Happy Valley Goose. Happy Valley Fire. Happy Valley Fire. And let's also put in an EMS here. Um, Happy Valley EMS. Happy Valley EMS. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. There is a police station that comes down here somewhere. Um. Green Street, uh, Play Crescent. Okay. Windsor Avenue. Pope's uh, Palazzo Crescent. Let's 
get rid of these. Rocks out of the way. Okay, so Palaser Crescent. How far does it go? Palaser Crescent. Uh, okay. It's not real, uh, not realistic. Uh, not, not real life, not a real life map, so it's going to make it a little bit challenging, but I'll work something out here. Okay. A lizard crescent. Or crescent. Okay, then we have Green Street that comes into it. Let's put Green Street. Green Street. And see how this is spelled here. Palliser Crescent. Okay. Palliser Crescent. Oh, it's with an E. Okay. Palliser Crescent. Okay. And let's see how this will connect. Mm -hmm. um, so from 10th, we do have uh, Pleasant Avenue, which comes across. I will put that in. Okay. Pleasant Avenue. <clears throat> okay. So there is another RCMP detachment here. Um, I think I'll put it right over here. Um, yeah. Um, Happy Valley. Happy Valley RCMP Detachment. Okay. And that is building a fine. Let's take a look at traffickers as to how many people are using this highway that I put in here. Oh, several. Oh, that's good. That's good. They're using the highway to go through. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Very good. So that's going to alleviate traffic for us up here. Oh, uh, somewhat. Yeah. It's made. It's made a difference, which is good to see. There is still quite a bit of traffic going through the city, but I mean, it kind of is what it is. I'm not going to be able to stop all of them from going through the city. Apparently. Okay. Let's take a look here. Okay, so Green Street, and you have Grenfeld. Yeah, this is not going to be too realistic of a build, but I mean, we're going to just make the best, to do the best we can here with this. Uh, I'm going to make Markland. Have Markland come through. I'm going to just bring Markland, and then I'm going to bring this into uh, Markland. There we go. Um, we'll call this Markland. Markland Drive. Assuming that's what it's called. Markland, oh, Markland Road. Okay. All right, and is there any park space in here? It would appear that there isn't. Uh, so I will have to just put uh, amusement in separately, which is not a problem. 
Okay. There we go. Okay, so it wants some more residential zoning. So we'll put in some more residential zoning in the area here. Services are pretty high in this area, so we should probably see speedy development. That'll be commercial, 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 commercial. Okay. There's kind of a loop kind of a thing here, and I do want to put this in. Um, there's like a park here kind of thing. I'm not sure what this wants to be here. Um, Grief Street. Um, primary school. Uh, let's see if there's a secondary school. Second secondary school uh, Goose Bay um, I'm not seeing a secondary school but there must be one um, okay so let me just put let me just search for school in here instead then school okay so that's a bit more helpful um, Queen of Peace Middle School. So we'll make that the secondary school. Queen of Peace. Does actually inside here. But let me wait with that. Let me try to construct uh, this, continue constructing this district here. Okay. So, um, uh, see, not enough educated people right there. The only issue we seem to have in this city, uh, which doesn't surprise me. Okay, um, there's nothing in there. Okay, Hope and Morris Crescent. So where does that go into? Uh, Kellen Drive goes into Heffler Street. Heffler Street. Okay, I see where this goes now. Okay. So let's go ahead and connect this. And uh, Heffler Street. So this is going to be Heffler Street. Heffler, Heffler Street. And that is Kelland Drive. It's just going to go into here like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So uh, let's finish up this area over here. So we have um, Morris Olive. Okay. Oliver Drive and Morris Crescent. Okay, so Oliver Drive. I'll deal with Oliver Drive first. Oliver Drive. Then we also have a street that comes out of there, just in such here is like that, and that will be called Morris Crescent. Mm, Morris Crescent, okay. Very good. Okay. So then up here, we are going to have um, a few more roads that go up here. Let me check quickly what goes up there. So we have, um, okay, so Churchill extends. Where's Churchill? Churchill extends all the way up. Okay. So let's grab that. Churchill will extend all the way up to there. That will also extend all the way up to there. Um, 
Yeah, I think I want to make that straight. We'll certainly do a better job with that. There we go. And let's... There we go. Okay. So, now let's put in some of the other roads that belong here. Pottle Street, Mitchell. Curves a little bit. Pottle Street and... Mitchell. And then let me just remove those. That's not realistic. Okay. There we go. Um, there's a street that cuts right through. In the middle here and it's not named there's no name for that street so we're just gonna leave it unnamed okay so let me just go ahead and extend the names of these streets okay and that was a difficult one to pronounce it took Tashina drive hey um, okay and then we have Pottle Street Mitchell Pottle Street and Mitchell, we'll call it Drive, doesn't say what it is, Mitchell Drive, okay. And that is done for up there, I believe that's it for up there, yeah it is. There's a Crescent, Martin Crescent, we'll put in Martin Crescent, uh, let me use these straight roads. Uh, well, there we go. Okay. Martin Crescent. Martin Crescent. Okay. There we go. Okay, so the city wants more industrial, so I will put in some more industrial. Not an issue. We have planned for that. There we go. Perfect. Oh, our park has leveled up to level 3. Fantastic. 111 visitors this week. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think what else I will do is actually make another side entrance for the park. Let me just extend the park area um, to there. And let's make a, let me make a separate entrance for it so we can connect the Happy Valley District better side gate perfect and let's get a road in good yeah yeah it looks like there's quite a few people using it it's nice to see okay so let me put in some residential zoning oh no, not there yet there we go okay not bad so what I think I will do is add in a secondary school. I'm going to put it over here. Um, it is called Queen of Peace Middle School. It's a middle school, but we're going to make it a secondary school. And I'm going to actually just put it over here. Um, so let's go over to our high schools. I'm going to use kind of a medium size. Since we're going to have only one, I'm going to probably make it a medium size. And that's too small. It's an elementary school anyways. So let's see here. 1,100. That's a good size. That's perfect. That is actually perfect. There we go. And let's call it... Oh, look at all the happiness. Uh, Queen of Peace... Uh, Queen of Peace Secondary School, we will call it. Uh, Queen of Peace Secondary School. We've already got 37 students there. Let me just watch that for a moment. 51 people. But I believe that 1100 is probably going to be large enough. If not, then we could just make it larger. Because we do have secondary schools that go up to 2500 people. So if we need to make it larger, we can. 107. Okay, so it's filling up as expected. Um... So we can probably put some more commercial zoning along the road here, I think. That'll be helpful. There we go, just like that. 
Did the industrial area develop? Yeah, the industrial area is developing. You've got to be careful with traffic in that area because there are going to be a lot of trucks coming in and out. But the nice thing here is that it has its own intersection. So it doesn't have to travel through the city and then out, which I really like. Because um, all there's this intersection from the highway so they can get on and off carrying resources in and out and then travel through here and then back out, out and go get back onto the highway and get out of the city, which I really like. And we also have the city of uh, the road connecting it to uh, the main road of Hamilton River Road. Um, and then the trucks can just come along here and then connect into their engines, bring the goods along to the commercial facilities, which is also really good. I think I may put a loop in here somewhere. Let me see real life what cities are because I may just want to put a loop in here so trucks can circle around because otherwise they have to go out and I don't, we, we, don't, we don't want that. We want them to be able to loop around somewhere. So Loring Drive actually has uh, Burnwood Drive. Um, incidentally, to our luck, we do have a road that comes along here. So that will be called Burnwood Drive. Burnwood Drive. Sounds like a really Canadian name. Uh, Burnwood Drive. Okay. Oh, look, they're already using it. Of course they're using it. They have to circle around somewhere, and that helps them circle around. Um, let me just take out traffic lights. Okay. And I'm sure we have some, some here as well, which we are going to remove. In a city of uh, this size, you literally don't need traffic lights. Like, literally just don't need them. Just double check everywhere to make sure that we don't have traffic lights holding up traffic. Because we really don't need that. And I think that what I'm going to do is put a second... Um, snow dump here but I'm just thinking about where it would be good to put it because I don't want it. they do make noise I think that what I would it's not a good place transportation wise to put it to put it over here because then they all have to go to the right and then around and etc but it may still be better than not putting it in so let me see if I could fit it in there it doesn't want to fit anywhere I don't want to put it here because of noise what about here it will allow me to put it here. You know what? I will do that. And we will call it the Happy Valley Happy Valley Snow Dump. I love this name, Happy Valley. I love this sister name. Happy Valley Snow Dump. Okay. There we go. See if there's another road that comes at the end of here. Um, Hamilton River. Oh, okay. Hamilton River ends there. Uh, we do have another road. Ah. Port Real Road, but if I can get it in, I probably can. Okay, so let's go back to roads here. Okay. Port Real. It just keeps going up a little bit. Okay. So, there we go, just like that. And then we have um, Mud Road, actually. That just uh, uh, probably actually is a Mud Road. Uh, let that curvy. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, so let's name these. Uh, Mud Lake Road. Mud Lake Road. And then over here we have um, Court Real Road. Port Real Road, and then we will extend the name of this road, extend the name of Kellen all the way to here. Perfect. Let's see if there's anything that goes in there. 
Um, Johnny Hill Drive. Oh, let's see if anything below that. Yeah, that's Markland Road. Markland Road. Cabot Street. Um. Oh no. Okay. No. 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 Johnny Hill Road. Okay. Johnny Hill Road. Okay, perfect. So it's called Johnny Hill Road. Uh, Johnny Hill Road. Yeah. Saunders Street. Let me have Saunders Street. Saunders Street. Okay, very good. Residential has uh, peaked on us again, so let's go ahead and put some residential in. How's the school for capacity? Ooh, it's rather large for capacity. Okay, so let me... It's rather full. Okay, so let's zone some more residential around here. And our city is up already up to 3,000 population. So we're almost, well, we're about one-third of the way through of the build already. Okay, so let's put some uh, entertainment in here. I'll put that here, actually. And that will go here. Okay. And I will actually be putting another school. We do need another school. So let me find another elementary school. Let's see what it's called first. Uh, Peacock Primary School. So that runs along inside here. Goes along here actually. Peacock Primary School. Um, oh, you gotta get it to high schools. This will not be a high school. Um, Uh, peacock. Let me check. Double check the spelling of it. Peacock. Oh. Peacock Elementary School. Okay, fantastic. Oh, there's people. Students already coming in. Okay, excellent. Okay. So that will conclude today's episode and build of uh, Goose Bay, Newfoundland, and we will be continuing the next episode. And uh, in the next episode, I believe I will make the next, next district and perhaps an oil industry. Uh, we shall see um, as I decide what we will be continuing with next. But thank you for watching, and don't forget to follow and subscribe, and um, I will see you next time.